I am going to discuss what how to connect MySQL database with Studio 3D. So first you are going to open Oracle Workbench. Sorry, MySQL Workbench. Then after going to log in with root user. Now thereafter here you can see this is the schemas or they are Sekila says TB and inside this is the tables. So record of the actor table. Thereafter I am moving on Studio 3D. So first here to connect my SQL with so to connect my SQL with Studio 3D first here you need to click on this import. After that, you can see JSON, CSV, B, Sun, but there I am going to connect with the MySQL. You need to select this SQL database. After configure, then you need to click here server. So, this place you can see the server. So, going to create new connection, clicking new connection, then after this place giving the name t mysql after doing this one here mysql selected so this is the version mysql you can select so this is the version 5.7 higher so you can or try with any of these tools so port you can see 330 3306 so here you can see uh, so it's uh, not visual but I'm going to open the workbench once again. Then you can see 3306 is the port, and this is the local instant MySQL version 8 8.0. And this is so I'm going to connect with the root user. And uh, here, let's give the username root, then after password give. And here, host, you can give your system name or you can write here local host thereafter database we need to give so what exactly is the database i already show you the database here so let's uh, uh, reconnect now here if i go on this schema so this is the database is there Sakila. And inside there, this are, uh, these are all tables. So let's give you the database name Sekila. After giving this all correct information, click on this test. So it's uh, OK. There is no any problem. Click on OK. Then save. And uh, here, we need to select the table also. So Sekila, there is the list of four tables. So going to use here actor actor that's come there here you can see column names this all there after for the target connection so target connection here let's right click and click on this add connection so connection sorry collect collection must be empty so here giving go uh, here m mysql db So MySQL TV, then create default collection, create, click on this create. Now when uh, this is uh, created, then after here you need to go on this. And uh, here, this is uh, the MySQL that's come there. So this here, click on this change. And then after give it so T Sony and they are just created MySQL TV. Now, if I take the cursor there, you can see there is no any records inside there. But when I click on this run, so it's so successfully here today, uh, 23, there is so completed. And when I take the cursor on M, my SQL TV, then you can see count 200 and this is the size. Now, I want to check the record inside uh, this tables this collection so for this one clicking open sql 
this is the SQL query automatic generated and click on this run then you can see this is the record inside this T M MySQL TB collection so this is the most uh, simplest way we can uh, connect or we can just import the MySQL data inside the MongoDB or Studio 3D. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.